Okay, so I've got a small document I just copied from BBC News right, about Toyota. I click on my project settings, you can see I've got the Microsoft uh, MT Enhanced using Microsoft Translator enabled. So I click on OK. I've got no TMs there, I've only got that. So I'm getting a result, of, so I'm in that segment, you can see the MT is in place. So I'm going to run a batch task to do the pre-translate. So I click on batch tasks, pre-translate files. And click on next. And now I can apply, apply automated translation when no match is found. That's what I've got here. I could have various settings here. I've done this once already just to check it with always override existing translation. That worked fine. So I'm going to use this time keep existing translation. There isn't one, so there should be nothing to keep. Minimum match value is 100. I finish. I should just run through and, and do something. It took a little while, so I'm guessing it was working. Click yes. Here we go. My document is pre-translated using machine translation from the Microsoft Translator. So my guess is that if this is not working for you, then perhaps you're not using the project settings. Perhaps you're using the file options um, settings in here to add MT or do something, I don't know. Um, that's the only thing I can think of. There's no other reason why it shouldn't work really. Just one quick check, one quick look again, so we can see what's in my project settings for batch processing and pre-translate. So I've just got to keep existing translation. And when no match found, apply automated translation. It's simple really, nothing else than that. I can't think of another reason or what might not be going well for you.